I'm Andrina Shufran with the Insect Adventure at Oklahoma State University, part of the Department of Entomology and Plant Pathology. And today, I have several different kinds of spiders. One of these is even deadly. This big spider is the tarantula. And this animal, while it is large and fast and very hairy, is harmless to people. In Oklahoma, there is one species of tarantula and you see them all over the place in the summer searching for mates. While tarantulas have big fangs, their venom's not dangerous to people. So they're not gonna make you sick. They're not gonna kill you. They won't make your arm rot off. This is the spider that most people feel very afraid about. This is the fiddleback, also known as the brown recluse. And its bite can cause people to have a very nasty sore. Only about 25% of people who get bitten actually get the sore. But it's still a spider you want to stay away from. While almost every home has fiddlebacks in them, some people have never seen them before. They're often confused with other spiders because though we hear the word fiddleback, we don't know where that fiddle shape on their body is located. And that fiddle is found as part of the eyes between the legs on the head of the spider. This animal is often confused with a fiddleback. This is a wolf spider, and it actually lives outdoors instead of inside. As you can see, the wolf spider has stripes all over its body. The fiddleback only has the fiddle marking on its head. The bite of a wolf spider isn't dangerous to anybody, and this animal is actually great to have around your house because it will eat all sorts of other bugs and insects that you don't want to have. This eight-legged friend is often confused with the fiddleback because it does have a little marking on its head and it's found indoors like the fiddleback is. This spider is called a cellar spider and you usually find them in basements or in hallways near the top of the ceiling where you often find a fiddleback down on the ground. The bite of a cellar spider is not dangerous to people. In fact, cellar spiders eat other spiders, so they're a good friend to have in your house. While several of these spiders are confused with the fiddleback, there are also spiders that are confused with the black widow. This little fuzzy friend is a jumping spider. And jumping spiders can be confused with black widows because jumping spiders are black and they have spots. Some of those spots are red or white, but the spots are all on their back where a black widow's spots are on her stomach. Jumping spiders are really numerous in Oklahoma and you'll see them all over the place. But no jumping spider is dangerous to a person and no jumping spider has ever killed anyone. This, on the other hand, is the dreaded black widow. And the black widow is the most dangerous spider that we have in Oklahoma. In fact, in the United States, and you can find black widows all the way into Alaska. Black widows have no hair on their body and their abdomens are round like a marble. They might have stripes or spots along their back, but they'll always have the red hourglass on their stomach. This animal is dangerous to people and you wanna stay away from it. About one person a year in the United States is killed by a black widow. More people in our country are killed by Christmas trees, but this animal is still one you wanna stay away from or treat if you find it in your home. If you'd like to learn more about these spiders or any other arthropods, please contact your local Cooperative Extension Service office or the Insect Adventure at our Insect Adventure website.